Determination is everything, isn't it? At age 42, she has taken a bold decision to enroll in school after she was labelled an illiterate. Her vision is to become a member of parliament in her constituency after school. So Stanley Nibley will spend some time with Ali Matu Naziru, who combines work with education to improve her life. Ali Matu is happily married with four children. Her firstborn has completed senior high school, while the last is in class one. In 2015, Alima decided to represent the people of her electoral area at the district assembly, so she filed to be voted for as an assembly member. Her highest educational level at the time was kindergarten. Na me sano, me kusku, ena me mami akabebi. Nti na me na na be fami akwa village. Na me na na hono ma kusku. She is fluent in the local languages but can't read nor write. In the run up to the elections, Alimatu's main contender called her illiterate. This convinced her supporters to vote against her. Eventually, she lost the opportunity to represent her people. <laughs> After nursing her disappointment, Alimatu decided to challenge herself. Five little fingers, five little fingers. The 42-year-old food vendor enrolled in class 2 at a public school nearby after discussing her ambition with her husband, who equally is an illiterate. This is what she does to support her family's upkeep and provide their educational needs. She is active and copes with class activities. Her colleagues have been sacked by the school authorities, so nobody discriminates against her. During break, she goes back to her business and cashes in. <laughs> Assistant head teacher Maria Matipa was happy Alimatu is learning fast. We thought maybe now that she's a grown person, she may rather uh, disturb the young ones. Maybe they may be laughing at her with her age and she may not be happy. But she said she can do that, so she has also agreed. Actually, she has actually mellow herself to that level. She said, Alimatu will be treated like a people, but the school will do more to support her development. With the availability of my second copy book, Alimatu strives to string words to form sentences with the help of her second born, who is in junior high school form one. Good morning, Peter. Good morning, Peter. How are you? How are you? She aspires to be a top-notch politician after school. Me to me go school no every year. Me when in the school, inshallah, say any time no pon no any I assemble woman and be jina be jina for MP. Me to me hold it. Her zeal for education has encouraged others to follow suit. Like Nelson Mandela, Ali Matu believes education is the right tool to shape her life and change her community. Good. Sit down. Never say never. Never say never. Yeah, challenging the status quo. Absolutely, and that, I love that second copy book, though. Yes, <laughs> it's, I My love the determination. Copy book, second copy book. And it should be an, an encouragement yeah. to lots of people out lots there. Lots of people. Really, it's coming.